Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Pisces Soul Tribe, what's going on you guys? Hopefully this day has been fulfilling to you and you've accomplished some things that you wanted to accomplish. But listen, I want to get into a general read for you guys, but um, I have some very unfortunate news. Um, somebody wants to approach you and it's definitely from your past, you guys. Um, some of you may be happy to hear that, I don't know. But um they want to approach you um, and they want to approach you because they see how well you're doing. Um, they see how happy you are. And you want to know what's funny? Um, I heard two songs back to back and y'all know normally I don't even talk about songs. But I heard um, Frank Ocean's A Tornado Flew Around My Room Before You Came. Excuse the mess it made. It usually doesn't rain in Southern California, much like Arizona. My eyes don't shed tears, but boy, they're poor when I'm thinking about you. And then, like, right after that, I heard, So I think I'm just about over being your girlfriend. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. So I'm getting a sense of, like, they really miss you. But I'm getting also a sense of you guys are pretty much feeling like Chris at Michelle. I'm over it. And I don't want to be here anymore. But um, let's see what's going on, you guys. Spirit of the Most High, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, um, higher beings, gods and goddesses, messages for the Pisces soul tribe, and any cross watchers we have um, currently watching. We bind and cancel any negative attacks. And we return those attacks to the sender tenfold so that we may continue to be edified, encouraged, and uplifted. Let's see what's going on, you guys. Spirit, what message? Well, we got the four swords at the bottom of the deck. So somebody's been thinking about this very heavily, very heavily. But um, they've been doing it under the geist of the moonlight um, after some sense of change. And like, I feel like they've honestly made an internal discovery. And with the Ace of Wands, they definitely are incoming. <clears throat> I feel like somebody views you as some as as celebration. You're the happy place, um, especially with the sun coming out. But with the hermit behind that, I feel like they're just continuing to keep that to themselves. But anywho, spirit, what message does this person have for Pisces? And we have the moon. So it's definitely something that they've been keeping to themselves. Spirit, what what else? What's the moon, spirit? Yeah, the Ten of Wands. Like, I feel like, excuse me. I feel like they they want to talk about how how overburdening the these thoughts have possibly been with the Four of Wands um, still at the bottom of the deck. Like, I feel like they're in a space where they felt like they could have done more to help you out. But let's see. Spirit, what's the Ten of Wands? Yeah, the Ten of Wands is the devil. But I think I feel like I'm just getting a sense of they're they're feeling very overburdened, possibly how how toxic that they may have um, been in a particular situation. Um, I feel like they have they kept up um, a lot of illusions and like I feel like they kept you in a in a in a space of just a cycle of honestly with the world at the bottom at the bottom of the deck it just feels very spiteful to be perfectly honest but like i feel like after after some sense of reflection they're realizing that they've been very nasty to you pisces spirit what's the devil and i hope the devil ain't what i think it is because i'm also getting a sense of lustful desires as well Yeah, the devil is the four of coins. Like, I feel like they, they're they feeling a little left out in the cold. Honestly, for themselves, as well as what they what they did for you. Like, I feel like they just put you in a space where um, you weren't good enough. And, like, I'm also getting a sense of them feeling like they're no longer good enough for you anymore because of because of where you are and honestly with the world still at, still at the bottom of the deck like i feel like Pis pisces you're sitting on top of the world but they do want to approach you 
with the chariot and then the eight of wands and they want to give you an offer to start over with the knight of coins but the eight of the eight of cups is right behind it so like i'm getting a sense of this is somewhere you don't want to be pisces um spirit what's the five of coins The King of Coins came out in reverse, you guys. So I feel like some. I feel like this is gonna be no good. And like honestly, I'm getting getting a sense of somebody who's possibly angry now. Like I feel like. I f it feels very vengeful with the Ten of Swords um, at the bottom of the deck as well. Yeah, but the Ten of Coins is right behind that with the Six of Cups. So this is definitely somebody you, you've you dealt with before. And they, they I feel like they just want to talk about a cycle. And, and, and I feel like they just did something very awful. Spirit, what's the King of Coins in reverse? Yeah, the Nine of Wands. Um... This is somebody you blocked off, Pisces. Like I'm get I'm getting a sense of you being very, very careful and very, very guarded um concerning um this King of Coins in reverse. Um you have the magician at the bottom of the deck as well as the ace of swords. And like I feel like they've been trying to manifest some type of uh possible meetup or some type of interaction with you um to speak on some type of clarity um that they've gained behind all of this. Spirit, what do they want to address? Yeah, they want to address an ending between you guys with the t with the death coming out. Like, I feel like they they want to talk about how something came to an end. But I'm also getting a sense of them possibly wanting um, to talk about how they changed. But honestly, with the king of coins in reverse and the devil to the five of coins, I'm seeing a bunch of illusion. And like I'm actually seeing somebody who honestly is putting up some sense of act just to get you back in another cycle. Spirit, what's the death? The death is the is a two of swords. They it was a head over heart decision, Pisces, and like I feel like you knew exactly what you were doing, um, honestly. And honestly, I'm not getting a sense of anything being different here. Like I'm feeling like somebody made this decision honestly because of how they see and view you now, and they see and view you now as somebody who's not playing any games with them. Like I don't really see. I don't see you backtracking here. I really don't. Um, Spirit, what's Pis how does Pisces feel in all of this? Where's Pisces? Does Pisces even want to talk, Spirit? The magician, like, I feel like you're in a space where you are manifesting what it is you want to manifest. And honestly, you are quite the resourceful individual because I feel like there was a sense of you being in a space where you were left out with nothing. But because you knew, um, <clears throat> excuse me, you had connectivity to the divine and you sought out on a mission to accomplish what it is you wanted to accomplish. You sought after everything you needed um, through the divine. You have your pentacles, you have your staves, you have your coins, and you have your swords. You have all the resources you need. And I don't feel like you're you're backtracking with the hermit at the bottom of the deck. Like I feel like you're on a on, on a journey of enlightenment for yourself. And you feel like you need to do this all alone because there's some introspection um that you are continually gaining. And I'm also getting a sense of through introspection and through people honestly rejecting you and casting you out, you awaken from the hermit um a completely different individual and a more highly elevated individual emerge from the dark light. That's a hermit bin. And you're separated I'm getting the sense of the hangman as well But Spirit, what's the magician? What is Pisces manifesting?
you're manifesting some sense of change. Like you're you're we you're you're going through an awakening phase. And honestly, I don't feel like you're you're being bothered by anything else. I feel like you, you with the judgment coming in, you made a sincere, fair judgment call. And like I feel like you're going after what it is you you want to go after. You are awakening, and that's the most important thing to you right now. Yeah, with the with the seven of swords um at the bottom of the deck. Like I feel like you you're you're blocking off things that you that you need to. And I also feel like you're be just becoming a tenacious individual. You have your goal in mind and that's what you're going after. Spirit, what's the judgment? Yeah, the judgment is is the page of cups. Like I feel like you're going after your dreams. You're going after what it is you you want to go after. Um, some of you are artists. Um, some of you are singers, songwriters. Um, I feel like some of you all could possibly be filmmakers. You're writers. Like I see you going after after your imagination, and that's what you're putting your time into. You're you're learning. You're learning how to cultivate your craft. With the Ace of Cups at the bottom um, of the deck. Spirit, is Pisces even on a love journey? Is love something that Pisces is looking for? No. <laughs> the Nine of Cups. You're in a space where you're saying, my cup first. But you are so happy um, by yourself. And, like, honestly, I feel like you're enjoying your, your time alone. You're, you're learning so much about yourself. Now, granted, you have a lot of love you can offer up. But I feel like in this given moment, um, you're keeping that love to yourself. Spirit. Should this person even approach Pisces? Will they approach Pisces? Because I don't see any action. The three of pentacles did fall out on the nine of wands. But like I said, the, the nine of wands is someone who is what they would call a wounded warrior. But they're seeking after some sense of collaboration with you. Um, and honestly, I could see why they want to work with you because you are an abundant individual. And like, I feel like you have turned your love inward. But still once again there is no there's no inspiration there's no action there's the hermit yet again i feel like this is just something that they're thinking something that they thought about and honestly something that they're keeping to themselves i feel like they're watching you i feel like they're watching you from a distance to be perfectly honest with the page of wands um at the bot at um, right behind the hermit they're watching you from a distance um and honestly they feel like you are still their their soulmate possibly with the lovers coming in and they do want sense of some sense of equal give and take with you but i feel like you're in in the queen of swords energy like you're you are cutting shit out like you are literally seeking after what you feel like your happy ending um is spirit but what's this three of coins what is it? What kind of collaboration is it they're seeking after? Yeah, the Three of Cups. They, they're they not wanting anything from you. Like, I feel like th this is just them imagining it. But the Three of Cups is, is abundance. But this is third parties. This is, I feel like they've been listening to a lot of people. And like, I feel like they're possibly collaborating um, with someone else. Their focus isn't on you, Pisces. I feel like they're thinking about you with the moon. And like thinking about how things played out between you both, but there's no action because honestly, I feel like they got a whole nother situation going on with the three of coins and, and the three of cups spirit. Is there someone else present with this person? Yeah, it is. Um, King of cups like they somebody's somebody's. Okay, before I say the spirit, what, who is this King of Cups? Who is this King of Cups spirit? Yeah, they're collaborating with somebody else. Um, six of Coins. Um, there's some sense. There's some equal give and take that they're giving to somebody else. And like, I feel like once again, they just see how happy it is you are. And like, I feel like there's some sense of them wanting to try to come in to kind of mess that up or try to, you know 
you know, distract you because that's what it feels like. It feels like a distraction. It feels like somebody's trying to poke the bear. But honestly, Pisces, I, w- I would say continue to focus on what it is you're focusing on. I feel like you're focusing on your passion. You're focusing on new projects. And I would say stay in that guy. Stay in the geist of the divine so that you can continue to move forward. Spirit, do you have any advice for Pisces? Yeah. Two of Cups, like focus forward and focus on what it is you love. Um, The Two of Cups, it could be another relationship. It could be a partnership. But like, I feel like with the Two of Cups coming in here, it's something new. It's not something that spirit wants you to work on with some with some older person. Yeah. With the star at the bottom of the deck, focus on your wish fulfillment, focus on your hopes and your dreams. Spirit Two of Cups. Four of Coins. Hold on. To your vision That's that's what I that, Hold on to your vision And honestly I will say Nurture after that Keep that on lock Spirit four coins Okay two Yeah with the temperance and um, the eight of coins, you're mastering something, but you you alchemize some change as well. Um, and you're also continuing to heal. So I feel like spirit is saying work, continue to work on your inner healing. You're in a very good place. Like, I don't have any bad vibes with this, but I feel like spirit is telling you to focus on your healing, focus on that change. And if it is some negative energy coming your way, transmute it and change it into something that you can make work for you. Well, it seems like that's it, Pisces. Like, I feel like, I feel like that's the that's the message. Like, hopefully, this message finds you in good favor. It will resonate with it resonates with you, and you're able to take something from it so you can continue to move forward. Um, thank you for the likes, the comments, the share, subscribe, su- su- yeah, for subscribing, and of course, if this message res- I don't know why I'm so tongue tied, you guys. I guess that was exciting. But if this message resonated with you, like, share, comment, and subscribe. And as always, Pisces Soul Tribe, conquer the rest of this day. Bye, guys.